He's formerly the number one pro tennis player in the world, currently number eight, known for his powerful serve and forehand, and founder at age 17 of the Andy Roddick Foundation. She is his mom and currently the director of the Andy Roddick Foundation, whose motto is helping children today for tomorrow. Mrs. Roddick, Andy, thank you so much for being with us today. Thank you. Andy, what are some of your most favorite fulfilling career accomplishments so far? Ooh, that's a... Uh... That's tough. Um, representing my country in Davis Cup and uh, not really missing any ties is, is something I take very seriously and I'm very proud of. Um, you know, having played in, in four Grand Slam finals is, uh, is, is a good accomplishment and also um, finishing in the top ten for seven years in a row uh, at least shows a little bit of consistency and um, you know, it, it's something that, that I'm proud of and uh, I hope to build on that. Of course, you should be. Now, you're known for your powerful forehand and hold the record for the fastest serve recorded in professional tennis at 155 miles per hour. Wow. So who do you think might be able to beat this record, either a male or a female? Hmm. Oof. Um, I'm not sure. You know, it, it's only a matter of time. I think hitting, hitting 130 or 135 was, uh, was a big deal, and now it seems like uh, every young kid does it. So uh, I, I'm not really sure who will break it. Hopefully... Uh, I mean, it'd be nice to be able to uh, maybe finish out my career with it, <laughs> and then, then it's okay. It's, it, it's up for grabs. Okay, so what's the most challenging part of being you these days? You know, the, always the most challenging part, but it's also the, one of the best parts is just trying to, you know, stay at the top of the game, but then, then deal with all the other stuff as well, and, uh, you know, um, in, including our, our, our foundation. But, you know, the, the, the thing that uh, makes it possible is having a, a great support team with my mom and, and, and her team uh, of volunteers that work year-round and tirelessly to help, uh, help with that. It, it does allow me to kind of focus on my selfish goals a little bit more. You are very lucky to have her, and I know that you're very close to your mom. How has she played a role in your success? Well, I mean, it, it, it wouldn't have been possible without, without my mom. Um, you know, everything from, from when I was trying to be a tennis player, for, from, uh, you know, their, their financial support to, uh, you know, she would spend her days between me and my brother who played tennis also, uh, you know, up at 5.30, 6 in the morning and driving us around from spot to spot to school and back till uh, 8 or 8.30. And now, especially with the foundation, um, you know, she handles everything day to day. Mrs. Roddick, you should be very proud. Now, tell me about the Andy Roddick Foundation and what your mission is for it. What kind of specific things does the Andy Roddick Foundation do to help children and families? The Andy Roddick Foundation's mission every day is to create a better life for underserved children. Because we're kind of a pass-through foundation, we have many people come and knock on our door and we're able, somebody comes in and said, the picnic tables at a youth shelter are rotten, can you help? So we were able to provide new tables. One, our school uniform program is a lady for $102,000 a year is able to provide 10,000 school uniforms to children. It must be very rewarding helping people with the Andy Roddick Foundation. Tell me how you feel after starting this charity eight years ago. Totally overwhelmed to the extent that we have been able to take it in the amount of money we have made and the number of organizations and children that we have been able to help. Part of the whole process that, that's exciting is, you know, for a number of years there, and it gets tougher and tougher each year, but we were able to double what we brought in the year before for, I think, four or five years. You know, fast forward, and, and, and last year we did an event, and, you know, we raised $1.8 million, and, and we're up, you know, close to, uh, you know, we're, we're above $10 million total, and that's just... Wow. Um, crazy for us to think about, and I think it... Uh, I think it those type of numbers and the fact that we're able to make a difference motivates us more. That is amazing. What website can we go for more information on you and the Andy Roddick Foundation? Go for it. What website? AndyRoddick.com. Click Charity and you'll be right there. <laughs> <laughs> well, we enjoyed talking with you today. I wish you the best of luck with your career and with the foundation. We hope to have you in the studio sometime soon. Thank you. Right, thank you for having okay. us. And don't miss my second exclusive interview with Andy Roddick and his mom coming up this Friday, same time, same network.